Oh, hey, Arlen. How you doing? Oh. You're an asshole, you know that? Tell everyone I was a hero. You were not. I I was a giant hero. Hey, look. Fire physics. It's fine. I-H, huh? Ira... something. Ira... Hellfire. That's- yes, that's my X-Man name. Part of the Hellfire Club. Destroyed by a monster of your own creation, Dr. Fontaine. What an un that story somewhere before. exciting way to go. I know, right? A guy just busts in the room and chokes the shit out of him and it fades to black. It's totally unglamorous. Kept yeah, his nails dirty, dude. He should have died on the toilet eating a sandwich. It's a good way to go. It's a good way to go. I really get How unfortuitous. <laughs> when I that you have discovered me in such a compromising <laughs> state. <laughs> oh, the state of me. What if, what if there was somebody who was like the opposite of Carradine? Who was like, they were gonna die in their bed, and they're like, no, no, gotta make this cool. Yeah, move me around. And then they climb into their, their closet. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <laughs> when I die, I want you to put my body in the most embarrassing position you yeah, can like manage. Yeah, like in your will. Or yeah. Something. Like on the ground, doing the running man. Or like midway. Boy, that's embarrassing. Bending your arms into like a swastika. Whoa, that's a bad one. Whoa. What? You got <laughs> like that cat. Yeah, the cat. Oh, that cat, right? Yeah. Oh, poor kitty. But uh, yeah, that kitty was a Nazi. <laughs> that's no, the cat. <laughs> oh no. That's what that's... that cat gets. <laughs> no, that's for not... hailing oh. Hitler. That's not how that worked, guys. That's not how that happened! Oh, no! Fucking son of a bitch, I'm glad he's dead. God, what he oh, deserved, no. that fucking... No. That, that Nazi cat. Wait, so... Fucking SS cat. <laughs> red Skull's cat. Oh, Red Skull's cat's probably super evil. Does it have Red Skull also? <laughs> oh, yeah, it has a little red kitty skull. Sure, why not? It's fucking Zeke Highland meows. Can't trust it. Oh, what? I thought that was another newspaper, but you got them all. 14 of 13. The chess piece. No. The, the music's still going on, so there's something. Nothing upstairs. Uh, Fontaine cordoned off his own office? Yeah, man. Like, I'm not allowed it's to got, go It's got to be in his office, right? Like... I'm not allowed to go up there. I'll, I'll use a tighter rope. And then I will give some water to my Nazi cat. There you go. Just shitloads of morphine. Are you for real, motherfucker? He's got On the so premises. many in front of everyone. Looks like Fontaine has finally dispensed his last treatment. No, you're missing one. Motherfucker. It's next to the newspaper. Box. No. Good doctor has been marking this map. Some. Yeah, use the tried and tested. Gotta do it one more time. Oh god. Look how cool that is. Shade it up. Amazing. Good job, Cole. It's very pretty. That's everything. Well, yeah, I think it wants you to complete. Okay. No. Edgewood Grove. McCarthy Vista. Crescent Heights, Rancho Escondido. Do those names mean anything to you, Herschel? Yeah. How come? Okay. Well, Rancho Escondido, we were we were fucking over there. The Whitnall Freeway divides Wilshire. New houses, all being built in the path of the freeway. Delivery. That's the trick. There you go. You build your junk houses and burn them down for the insurance money, but you still own the land. Then, your junk houses that are being rebuilt get bought by out by the government in order to build the freeway, increasing the land value by, like, a billion. That's the scam. Ba -ba bam okay. Is this it? Are we done now? Well, did, he didn't... he didn't... He didn't have his aha moment. 
I think he might I think have. I think the talking to Herschel was the aha. Well, we'll back out and see if you get Yeah, back out. Yeah, there okay, go. there you go. Here's your aha moment. Jack was wrong. It's not about insurance, it's about eminent domain. What are you talking about, Cole? That? The government the reclaims the land in the path of the freeway and pays the improved value of the land with the new houses sitting on it. What about the stiffs who paid their deposits? Worst case, they get their money back. But the syndicate pockets millions yep. on the improved value yep. of the yep. land. That's a good so scheme. Jack's boss That's a good scheme. He's the key. He carries the insurance. Fucking the insurance Avon and the Stringer were running and that and fucking one. racket right, right. before they got all of them. That's impossible. Good, it, it, yo, it is a good Imagine. hustle. But you need to know where, where it's the, gonna where be. Where the thing is gonna be built. One Herschel go. That's a scam. In. We should get we, in on this. We had a similar but get somewhat different get scam happen in Montreal recently, where they were extending the path of the metro subway, and they accidentally dug the two the miles too far. The the fucking metro too far, two miles too far, and it happened to be right next to this suburban mini mall. Yep. So, just happened to be. Now we'll just have so the metro, Centre Laval. So the, the new metro yeah. exit just happens to be yeah. two miles over. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pretty, pretty funny stuff. Pretty sneaky, sis. I remember, like, reading that, and it's like, do these motherfuckers expect me to believe that you tunneled for weeks? Not extra? knowing that you went beyond <laughs> the line? Yeah, exactly. Get yeah. the fuck out of here. I remember hearing about how they uh, some of the early ways of getting heroin into the country yeah. involved like boats going like two miles off the shore, dropping heavy shit with uh, packages of heroin down to the bottom of the ocean, waited, and then after 12 hours, they'd pop and float up to the top, and fishermen would just come pick it up. That's good. I like Fucking that. Fucking crazy. That's good stuff. Criminals are crazy, the best. dude. They're so creative. Yeah. Guess nobody's home. I'll just bust in. Yeah. Like that. Yeah, this looks like a psycho murderer apartment. Oh, his flamethrower, huh? Are we at the end of True Detective? A little bit. So, Wooly, I saw something really interesting. There was a DLC case from Mafia 3. Remember the one in Louisiana we played? Louisiana. There is literally a fucking uh, ending of... No, ending, but like... The, the creepy aspects of True Detective Season 1. That's when the DLC... Bits where you're fighting like this cult that worships the Yellow King. Awesome. Oh. It looked really cool. Like, I might even try to play it. Actually, the Yellow King? Well, just, you know, another approximation. A, a kind of thing like that. That's cool. This place looks like shit. Uh, Kelso, you're not impressing me with your under the arm flashlight skills. Hey, grab that, grab it good. Crawl a kill. I mean, it's got to be a fun job coming up with extermination names. Yeah. I like Bork Stoppers. Yep, yep. Pop Snuffers was a good one. A screwdriver. Made for yep. opening paint cans. Meow Mufflers. Meow Mufflers is real good. Yep, yep, yep. That's real Oh, uh, that's the back door. Yes, it, it is. sure is. Lots of gold. I don't remember, but I think you have to find the one mega clue. Yeah, mega clues. If you ever build a house, don't put golden door handles on Never. it. Never. Because it gives cops free reign. There's it's the flashback room. noise. There's the origami room. The origami killer. It's the flashback to yep. the war noise. Yep, yep. That's what, that's what these paper cranes may remind you of. Go into a kill frenzy. I'm getting a hot combo streak with my flamethrower. He's getting blood drunk. What do we got? Huh. Suspicious. It was either that or a sign saying that I don't like you. You are a big poopy pants. Mm. Nailed it. Alright, let's... Quite a flock, you Let's got look at the kid. crime museum. <laughs> the tunnels. The river tunnels. This guy's a tunnel rat. Damn. All right. All right. We're Remember going that? underground. We're going deeper underground. Remember that GI Joe Extreme character is just called Tunnel Rat. GI Joe Extreme. Extreme. The odds are a billion to what? Black Dragon. Finish the line, Matt. Sorry, what was it? The odds are a million to one. The 
that's all we need or something. And that's the way we like it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah Chuck's dream. There's Tunnel Rat, there's Black Dragon, there was like... Not Roadblock. There's like, yeah. What the fuck is that? Giant Badrock Black guy. Is that the Valve? Metalhead! Remember Metalhead? He was kind of just had this guitar that shot sonic waves. Why would you have such a man in your military force? Because they're extreme. Metalhead! He was the voice of Rio uh, from, um... Or, sorry, the voice of fucking Terry Bogard. Okay. No, no, not Terry Bogard. God damn it. Laucorn. Laucorn got him as. That's a Tommy gun. Yep. But he had a flamethrower just now, so this is the least of my worries, quite Sorry, frankly. And he's, he's, so am I gonna be chasing him through the tunnels? So that's what's going down. You had to miss something the fucking. Yep, yeah, we're gonna. Good time to uh, start tapping. Well. Let's start tapping. No, I was gonna say. What am, what am I gonna say? I don't know what you're gonna say. Patch should know what I'm gonna what say. Do you know? Uh, what? something in the crane room. I'm about to do some wugging. Some hall wagon. Hall wagon. No, it's in the crane room. The thing you missed. Or the origami. Yeah, whatever, whatever you want to call it. Crane origomo. The enemy. That's there. It is. The enemy paper oh, no. room. Wait. No, that's. The You're looking for a photo on the wall. There it is. Yeah, yeah. Oh shit! I know those faces. Jesus now, Christ, uh, I know every one of them. There's Cole all the way to the right. Yep. So I assume it's the biggest guy. Yep. Iroh was part of the crew. Oh my god. Fuck. You poor backwards son of a bitch. And now all those war flashbacks tie into the main they plot. They actually know him and the whole time he was part of the crew. God Peterson, damn it. Peterson, I'm going to need some help. I've got Monroe, Fontaine, and all the others. It's all tied up nicely. It goes all the way to the top. Meet me at the LA River Tunnel We need one more flashback with Ira hanging out behind Don't Cole, flicking his lighter all the time. You do need one more flashback. Staring at it. I sure like fire. Well, because remember you had flashbacks of them having to burn a bunch of houses? Yeah. And a guy went in. A guy went into the caves and they were like, who? And Cole goes, who ordered him to do that? And they go, you did, Cole? Mm hmm. I wonder who that guy was. And, and then he was like, that doesn't sound like me. Are you sure? It was me? Ira. More like... Fyra! Hey! Go ahead, KGPO. Fuck. <laughs> Suspect outstanding in the LA River tunnel system with a hostage. 11K and Roger two that. Three. Well, that's that then. Uh, All right, Jack here we go. Like a suicide note. Half the LAPD will be down there hunting for us. We need to get there first. Cole, if you want to save your German whore, you're gonna have to go running through the sewers. In the shit where you deserve to live. Described as a Navy Chevrolet fleet line. License number four, William, zero, two, eight, six. Right, waste of time. Car 86 Adam is in pursuit. I picked up his car. I'll need help to make it to the river. So Jack Kelso calls it in, and then all the crooked LAPD are like, gotta kill Kelso. Yeah, Jesus. basically. basically. <laughs> Holy like, shit, yeah. we gotta kill that guy big and hard. The guy that called it in. That's Kelso's car. Being chased by the cops. God, you... Fucking! Okay, you're supposed to escort you crooks! Dad. You goddamn fucking on the take, sons you gotta, of bitches! You gotta kill all the cops, bully. Ah. Uh, well, it ain't ever gotten no more noir than it does right now. <laughs> well, it's rainy. The this streets is... are black and evil. Oh, you fucked that thing up! This beat of noir I've been looking for. Look at this. This is awesome. Oh yeah, he's done. Jesus Christ! How many cops are these guys on? All of the cops. Like it just occurred to me there hasn't been a. Wow! What that did you hit? A, that was a, a garbage can. A garbage can. Hey man, they make them tough. That was insane. It was also invisible. Yeah. We haven't hit a rainy night until now. I think we might have, but I really don't remember. 
How come all of their cars are so light compared to your car? Is it heavy with your morality? Your burden. They're light with the fucking AI cheats. Like you I just said. blew that guy into pieces. Oh shit! Yeah, I just gotta distract him, that's all. Okay, this guy up ahead first, though. They don't look very distracting. Oh my god, please hurry up. I, I wonder if Kelso's in the car going like, what's up with this? Man, that one evil cop seems to be not as evil as the rest. I mean, he's not trying anything funny. I imagine Roy, like, they don't all need to be necessarily corrupt, but whoever arranged it orders, to be called orders. in oh, needs shit. to be I, I didn't have to do nothing. That's great. So, like, Roy is like, call this in like yeah. this. And send in good cops to do dirty work. Bad cops. Roy has, like, a Bluetooth headset on, and he's screaming at all his corrupt buddies to fucking kill that Jack. Listen, Jack Kelso's an evil hitman. You need to yeah. bring everyone. And the dispatch goes, everyone? Everyone! Thank you, Earl. It's like when the Jackal tells the Punisher, you should kill Spider-Man. He's like, really? Spider-Man? He's like, yeah. Punisher's like, alright. I guess he committed a crime once. Sometime. Let's do it. Who is this guy? Peterson, assistant DA. What's he doing? He's here, here to cover our backs. I'm going in there, Jack. He just no fucking dodged bullets. You. I found this at the ranch house. He's marked his routes. I'll go in You here. guys sound go like you have a very sentence. limited amount of time Wait, to make these decisions. But even if you take here. him down, the cops are still on your ass, and they're not going to pretend they weren't being no. corrupt. Got it. Got it. <laughs> How do you solve this case when everyone's Peterson, fucking on you? you? DA, we'll earn your salt. So, Kelso is your boy, Peterson? Oh, boy. You're working with Kelso? Oh, boy. Oh. Oh. Man, you love that Kelso. Yes, remember this corruption chief. aura is... Remember, is remember the chief is part of the suburban system. redevelopment fund. Like, you can the feel the, the, the era, the aura like, coming off of him. Oh, so you're the new broom, Peterson? Looks like it. God, if anyone reads Vagabond, then they know what the... the the violent urge looks like it's coming off of this hey, guy. Hey, district you attorney, that's not gonna play He's ball with this. How about we shoot of. you to death All and right, leave your Peterson. body here? Basically. I'm listening. What's your offer? Ah. Man, fuck everyone in this story. I know, I know, but he's smart for doing that. I thought that was cool for a second. Boy, Kelso. I sure hope the DA has your back with all these fucking cops you're killing. <laughs> How many bullets does that fucker take? Enough. See, when, you, when you're like, ooh, I can get corrupt money and be on the take, that power is you. I gotta say, great. corrupt money tastes a lot better than regular oh, clean money. I disagree, because I feel like you're nervous all the time. No, once, the, once I have the money, I don't feel nervous. Yeah. Maybe up until I get it, I'm Yeah, up until that KI check comes in, you're very nervous, but it then you have the KI it check. It still hasn't cleared. Really? No. Come on, man. I, I talked to them, but they don't You need to take them. back all your praise. Exactly. Seriously, you've just killed like nine cops. Yep. Yeah. Ten. And even a ghost, maybe. I even killed the ghost cops. Oh, fuck. They called in the ghost cops? Oh. Is that the ghost of Stonewall Jackson? <laughs> a mint julep awaits you on the other side. <gasps> Man, you fucking love that bit. <laughs> it's my oh, to your lap. It's my favorite moment. Oh, he's on a higher level, though. No, he's on a lower level. That's what the arrow means. Yeah. You gotta go down into the into the stink hole. Okay. Yeah, Maybe I can get a little snipey yeah. snipe. Yeah, the, the the Tommy gun is considered a sniper weapon. Does he know I'm there? I don't know. Well, he knows now. Oh, that's wow, what was his yeah. plan? Yeah. How do you not just down. jump off the ladder? This slimy ladder. Oh, yeah. There oh, you yeah. go. That's that physics engine we've been looking for. Let's I love see it. what the other criminals are doing. Kerplog! Oh, I love it. Wait, look back at him? No. Okay, it's okay. too late now. You're pretty great for a dead man. Am I? You let me run to cover. It's appreciated. Really? 
Wow. Oh, behind you. Shit. Yeah, they're coming down there. Many strong men await you. I love how they're indirectly telling you where to go by being in your way. Yeah. That's what that's what Don't they do. Don't come down Flush here. <laughs> oh! You're dead at last. You can't shoot me. Lethal enforcers. <laughs> here he comes. The fury. That was that. Oh, whoops. Fucking whoops, man. All right. All right, Ira. Ah, oh, shit. Don't worry about those guys. Oh, another guy just caught on fire! Where are you going, man? For cover. From that fucking ridiculous well, the, those gun. Pillar, those pillars and those grates will do but it But the you. bullet, yeah, okay. Ow. Ow. Your hat, Kelso, your hat! How will you ever get the final cutscene with And there's hat? a guy in the window down there. He's dead, and there's another guy in the window. Oh, he's actually to the left there. You shot him a little bit. Not enough. He's very... He needs a few more shots to be... Wow, he's very far away. Oh, you killed him. And now the other guy's so far away that you don't even see him on your map. You got your hat back, Kelso! Gotta finish the mission with the hat. Wouldn't... Wouldn't, like... Kelso be oh you know what the place you were going that had a staircase down yes, it did. Uh, wouldn't Kelso be like near vomiting from pain shooting with that arm adrenaline adrenaline does amazing things yeah no vomit gets counteracted by adrenaline they're like two competing chemicals boy it's gonna be easy to rob a bank in LA pretty soon <laughs> the chemical of vomiting oh shit okay yeah mind. but you have this wonderful thing you just picked up somebody else's gun. Now all these criminals to shout at you like, "Don't kill us! We just wanted corrupt money." Is that a bar? Turn, turn the camera, please. A bar? Uh, that might be a bar. Yeah. I mean, we used to use them back in the day. Bars are better than a Tommy gun. No? Yes. Okay. It's like a fucking machine gun. Uh oh. That spawn. You gotta get to the other side, Kelso. Fuck, where's the- where's the way up, though? I guess it's on the other- like, just uh, straight across. That is a BAR. Look, I- I stopped walking, I stopped walking, I can't walk. Yeah, you gotta go through the catwalk. Yeah, the catwalk. Turn, 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 through that. Oh, through the middle, okay. I couldn't really tell what the ground was. Well, it is all water, so... And, do you see a ladder? Yeah, that way. So you cross that, and then you go to the right, all the way to the corner. See that? Oh, yeah. fuck. That's far as shit! That's super far. And the water's pushing you in the wrong direction. Oh, now your butt's getting wet. My wallet's useless. Damn it. I suppose you did worse in the water. You can do it, Kelso. You can do it. And wet guns are worthless. Guys <sighs> keeping it safely above the water. I think the bar is actually pretty good when it's wet. Your AKs are probably your best bet. AK is always the best. Part. Not sure if they had an AK. When you absolutely, positively gotta kill every, every motherfucker, motherfucker in the room, except no substitutes, except for a bar. A bar is a bar. Is I love all right. a bar. Bar is all right. Just wish they had larger magazines. Yeah, I want a fancy reload. In most games, bars only have twenty-round magazines, and that's not enough. I wanted to have a billion. Oh, he got it hard. Look, the god light! Yeah, well, that's... Can't go that way. Damn! The god light lied! Maybe go to the god light where it doesn't have... Oh, that god light over there. A lot of, a lot of, a lot of dead cops for one German broad. The, the god light I came oh, from? Oh, shit! No, that's not the one you... Can. I can't make that jump. No, you can't. You don't have to go around. Just try all the god lights. Oh, like that one. one. That a one. Yep. Are you okay, princess? Where'd your hat go? I felt better. He saved me from the doctor. But then he Hi, used the monster. You remember me? I'm not sure that I do. Have you come here to kill her? Why would I do that, soldier? Isn't that why you're all here? I'm here to get her out. 
You did a good thing, but you burnt a family, dude. You haven't come for me. No, not you. It ends here. You were with the sixth on Sugarloaf, weren't you? I was. And Naha? Yes, I was. You're Sergeant Jack Kelso, aren't you? Where's your uniform, Sarge? At home in my locker, Hogaboom. War's over, soldier. I know that, Sarge. I'm fighting a different kind of war. There I fight go. for God now. We all fight for God, Ira. In our own ways. Not everyone knows it. Elsa, are you all right? Get away from her! It's all right, Cole. He doesn't want to hurt her. Ira was with us on Okinawa. What? You know this guy? Don't you remember me, Lieutenant? Jesus Christ, Cole, you don't even I fucking mean, remember him. No. The guy who got you your no. award. You ordered me to burn that cave, Lieutenant. That cave full of civilians. Oops. Mm. Whoops. What is he talking about? It was Wet hair, Cole. For God's sake, I can't be held responsible for everything. No, you happened. super can, actually. I don't blame you, Lieutenant. You helped me to help other people. You created him. Ira lost his mind on Okinawa, Princess. Sheldon asked the doctor to help him get back. The doctor helped me to find my path. I like that we and get I here and it's like it's 100% Cole's now, fault. Yep. Will be all right. You've helped her too. Get her I mean, war is shitty and you kind of make bad mind. decisions. Jack, I need this guy to but make the case. Take I responsibility. Cole was like, oh, just burn that cave. Get out of here now. Burn it all. Jack. What are you going to do? Don't cry, miss. Sergeant Kelso has come to help ease my way. I was proud to serve with you, Jack. Get out of here, Cole! Ah, uh, quarantine. No Kikongo. No Kikongo. There we go. them off. Do it humanely. We are leaving this place. You do it, Phelps. Get your own fucking hands dirty. I'm out of morphine. Put these people out of the Oh, you pain. forgot about that guy? Now, yeah. That's an order. Jesus fuck. And that's how he got wounded that's and got his he, medal. Yep. 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 Everyone out of here now. Double time! <laughs> yep. Get to an aid station. Weapon team will be blowing this place in that two That was Courtney. Minutes. Yep. Everything yeah. that happened in here stays in here. Do you hear me? Holy fuck. I don't want to ever hear another word about it. <laughs> Holy fuck. Ah, so everything about that, it's like it's 100% oh. Cole's fault. He forgets who wow. Ira is. Wow. wow. Kelso just lets Courtney shoot Cole because fuck it. Right? Yeah, but it's not like Cole said, let's burn this cave. All right, well, yeah, but the problem is he didn't care enough to not burn the cave of civilians. Okay, well, we know who the real hero is. Ooh. That was kind of sudden. Very. Wow. Well, fucking Kelso's the man. <laughs> Kelso is Kelso's the Kelso's the actual main character. And the actual good person. Phelps was a good guy, but he was a fake Captain America. He was also terrible at his job in the military. Because he didn't care, he just wanted to climb the ranks. Isn't that nice? But, but he wasn't a bad person. No. There were lots of fucking... Deplorables. Complete, deplorable pieces of shit. Completely 
like corru- uh, disgusting Detective pieces Cole of shit. Oh, look, and he he, here, and yeah. fucking Roy gets to read it <laughs> out. Cole Phelps was the best kind of man. Uh, I think Kelsey uh, is happy. Uh, war hero who led his men with true valor. Oh, oh man. the fucking vi- so bile in my throat. <laughs> it's so bad. Speaking of bad people. Honors. I'm going to barf on the mic. Wrongly accused. <sighs> Who never lost his faith in the LAPD and the system. Fine. You belittle his memory. Elsa. Get out of my way, Jack. You call yourself his friend. A detective who fought to expose the evil corruption. Good for you, Elsa. The Holy Dr. shit. Fontaine and the rapacious property tycoon, Leyland Monroe. Go to her. Will you, Herschel? A reformer. Who we'll recognized the need Jack. to remove the odd bad apple. From a department right. made up of good men. Herschel? A man who never gave up. Yeah, Jack. Who continued to fight enemy. the good fight. I think you knew that, Jack. The fight that cost him his own life. Just pull out your gun and just shoot Roy right here. Right now. Put him a in the same husband. box. It's faster that way. A good father. And may I say... Also, fuck the DA. You can't, you can't, you can't. To be super fair, you, Roy is doing an excellent acting that. job on this. Like, his look voice was quavering. Yeah. And, but you can't, like, you can't solve the big ones. They're too big for you. And there he is, shaking fucking hands. Ugh, like, what a hero cop, Roy Earl. Of course you were getting played. Of course you were getting played. So I thought for a second I don't think so. that I assumed you said that about uh, Yakuza. Yeah, I did say that. If I may, I assumed that when he's like, "What's your offer?" He was gonna be like, "Let me stall for time." But clearly, no. What's your offer? Legitimately meant, "What's your offer?" And now you're in on the fucking council of shit. The Council of fucking... Council of Shitlords, I guess. Uh. Yeah, no, it's not exactly the most feel-good game. Oh, there, there is, in out. fact, an after credit okay, scene. Right, so... He fucking makes his offer, you he gets move, his spot... Move, will you want to move the sticks a bit, just to see if it might speed things up sometimes? It does Maybe not. Maybe you can click a button. No, but then that might skip. Oh. We always have to and do. then, and then after that fucking shit, he, 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 he shakes hands with Roy up there, and he's clearly in, and he's got the cahoots going. And that sucks! And I guess the idea is that Roy is your, is your fucking... Escapes super criminal to, to, to fucking live another day villain. And if there was an LA Noir too, I suppose you so. get your comeuppance there. With uh, I don't know, I feel like it's pretty appropriate to a Noir story that like the bad guys super win. You. Yeah, they like yeah. a bunch of them got fucking killed, but, but overall, really... like the problem is too big, people are too corrupt. Well, the problem that got out of hand is solved, right. But the evil remains. So, like, think about this. The new scheme. What happened to Benson? What happened to is Benson? Is the answer nothing? Because I think the answer is nothing. So, in that <laughs> film, in that film, whom, who was sitting around? Uh, the chief, the head of the paper, Monroe, Fontaine, and Benson. And we saw them all, except for him. Yeah, Chief got out, no problem, because he's the police chief. If anyone's going to get out, it's going to be him. Of course. Uh, paper guy is never brought up ever again. So what did that film... Did anyone keep that film? Well, paper guy is is fucking pedophile, and then... And who found it? No, 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 you're thinking, of, you're thinking of the fire insurance, life fire... Right. Yeah, life fire and life. But, well, fuck it, the paper guy's a pedophile, too. Fuck it, they all Probably. just love it. They were all found with children. In compromising position. What's up with this? The end. I still can't get over how disgusting Benson is. Where he's like, yeah, your ideas of love are quaint. And and for and how <laughs> they went as far as to have the child go, it's not so bad. Rage. The thing that makes it the worst. That's what it was called, rage. The rage technology. Uh, I'm raging right now. Forgot all about that. The thought of these fucks. 
God damn so it. So apparently as big of an asshole as Brandon McNamara was running his company and shit. Into the ground. The game is incredibly well written. Now, like, granted. It's got a really good script. Yeah, that came together really well at the end. Mm. Uh, I, and the whole time, I have to say, I know you guys are kind of like, definitely like, you know, you're like, yeah, the newspapers, the, the story, they're building yeah. up to something. Um, it was a, it was kind of loose at points where you're like, okay, but where? What do we, what? You know? mm, yeah. But that came together really um, well. Like, to be fair, though, like, uh, a rock star, I think, like, took over development of this game for, like, eight months. Really? Once it, really, once... Yeah, the, it listed rock, uh, rock star San Diego. Yeah, rock star San Diego. And, so they did more than publish. And came over and were like, are you ever going to fucking finish this? And Brian McNamara's like, if only I could crutch them harder! And they went, uh... <laughs> and they went, okay... Maybe we'll help out a little bit, and they like helped clean up like developmental pipeline shit, and like organize where the game was gonna go and stuff like that. Um, I mean, they gave them the tech, clearly. Yeah, but just like yeah, no, the way that this game was developed was super fucked up. Like McNamara is a super crooked asshole boss, and he is a bad man. It's a shame that there aren't more crooked asshole mega yeah, cruncher well, bosses. More. Video games like this. Well. It, I remember when it was being added. Perhaps a less expensive version. Do you remember the ads for this game and how confusing they were? Barely. Okay, so the ads for this game was like, you're gonna be a cool cop, and it showed like a bunch of action scenes, yeah. and Cole yelling at people. And because nobody knew how to advertise a game that was 99% just talking to people yep. about, you know, uh, brooms and, and, and fingerprints and shit. But... It's like, it's very similar to how... God, what fucking game was it? Was it Yakuza 4? Yeah, it was Yakuza 4. Matt, do you remember those weird ads of the smooth-talking, cigar-chomping, like, cool man to... Look at all the cool things you could do in the under-seedy belly of Gamarocho. You could meet hot ladies and play pool... And it was, like, super tone-deaf to what that series is actually like. Yeah. It's like, I don't know. Because no one in Yakuza is actually cool. No, they're, they're all dorks. They're all huge dorks, especially Majima. Well, but especially Kiryu. the dork captain. Well, the dork king, emperor, god is Cole Phelps yes. for all time. There's never been a man more dork. It's just, and he starts to come around right at the end, when he tells Roy off. It's the single. Yeah, it's yeah. my favorite moment in the whole game. I, I'm a bit. Bothered by the fact that we don't get a full explanation for why he just went fuck it. I'm cheating But you know what? I guess you that's need human. One? I guess that's human, right? She so was I, hot. I like that I guess. She probably did creepy German things his wife wouldn't do. Oh, you put that where? See see I made that joke earlier and you were like, ew, Pat, no one was doing it. No, no you're doing it? No, you see, you went full-on shizer. With the poopy. And I just implied a finger going in. Oh, wow, that's... I don't know what you... That's mean. almost worse. <laughs> like, you're a weirdo. <laughs> and you know who's not a weirdo? Jack fucking Kelso. I don't know. I, I almost regret that he came in so late. Could you imagine if Kelso and Phelps were on one team at a time? I, I, I think the game should have actually I, been half and half. I don't know about that. I don't know. Because that would force, like, an enormous part of the game to be about the big case. Instead of, like, because well, our, our okay, okay, about the Okay, hold case. on. The game almost felt like it could have wrapped up at Black Dahlia. Because that was a huge... Yeah, yeah, because there's no larger plot. And it's just like, wow, that was a, that was a cool game. Until said point. And then once you get in a vice, you start to get little hints of the morphine, little 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 little, God, little droplets no, of the morphine. The morphine. And right. then the redevelopment. Would plan. you like some morphine? No. Redevelopment plan. I bet you seem frustrated and in a lot of pain. I bet morphine would help you out with that. I don't want it. Okay. Want redevelopment it. plan. Matt yeah, needs morphine. Redevelopment plan. Matt needs morphine. <laughs> oh, also, if you saw me get annoyed, it's like. When, when we when we like kind of marathonish a game like this, it's like I get really because you start noticing things you mm -hmm. would notice if you played this normally like yeah. you just bought it like hey I'll play some here I'll play some there whatever mm -hmm. it's just like the the reuse of the line like where's your proof like and like no one has they 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 can't write it to be different it needs to it needs to ask a highly specific question yeah, there's yeah, only yeah. so many yeah, ways and that's well ask. done no that questioning system is well done I I appreciate I appreciate the press turn system I I seriously 
think that it was a massive mistake to change that to doubt. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Doubt lie He's truth. Because it's more black, white, and gray. Yeah. But so I can understand the last minute logic there. But I. But um, it should have been like coerce, press, and accuse. Was uh, it? No, no. It was. It was. It was. I think it was truth, press, lie. Okay. And, and it was. It just press changed from uh, press to doubt. Yeah, and that that, that button makes a lot more sense. So Phoenix Strike uses press. And like, I don't know. Like. Maybe it's it's the R mistake because like doubt is supposed to be a verb, and it's like doubt them. I'm doubting you. Yeah. But I don't know. It just doesn't like because it, it it causes weird things where you hit doubt and Cole starts yelling. Right. And you're like what? But but also when you say press, you're like for for me it's Phoenix Wright. You press for more information. Like give me any additional details. Yeah, yeah, If yeah. you have them, but they're like no. It, it should have. These have to be. Three things that can lead to it's but, a but you get your a success. But you get your fail safe by accusing them and then backing it out. Oh, in addition, thanks but Shuhei I think that's Yoshida. What should have been. Huh. It should have been like threaten. Mm. Yeah, threaten. Yeah, I think that pull out right. pull out your gun and right. threaten. And of course the facial expressions went right out the window by the end. Like they oh, were some of them. they were pretty much there, but there were a, cu a couple mm. that were. Alright, let's do it. The final flashback. Newspaper 15. How about this for a headline? Guess which former Sixth Marine hero has been promoted in the LAPD? No idea. Well, it could be anybody. You give up? Tell us or hand over the fucking paper. The Shadow Boys, our very own Silver Star winning son of a bitch. Phelps, he didn't die, Jack. He did just fine, and that's all we're going to say about it, right? The one and only. Look at this picture. Golden Boy getting his badge, wiping his kids and toe, and looking awful humble in the process. Well, he's that phony bastard. I wonder if they've been holding my job for me after all this time. What job was that? Mechanic. Ain't you seen all the war bond movies, Sarge? All the best mechanics is women. You're gonna have to work as a gigolo from here on in. <laughs> I was a bus driver in Santa Cruz. No, no pictures in the papers or medals for me, though. I can't believe I just went through Petaloo and Okinawa just to go back to being a washing machine mechanic. How is it that jerks like Phelps get it all? It doesn't have to be that way, guys. What are you talking about? It's always going to be that way. Do you have any idea what you guys are sitting on? Yeah, a ship full of army surplus. You're sitting on surplus morphine. Two tons of it. Can you imagine what that's worth on the streets? Hundreds of thousands of dollars. You're shitting me. I'm not. You're talking about stealing it? Keep your voice down. Do you want to have us all thrown in the brig? God damn it, Sheldon. You want to go into the dope business? No. I want to be in the peace dividend business. What is that supposed to mean? It means I want the guys who fought for a better future to get some share of it. You interested, Jack? Come on, Top. We could all get out from under. Oh, it's the chance of our lives. It's everyone or no one, boys. I'm not having a bar of it, Courtney. You may be the bravest person I have ever met, but I swear to God, trouble follows you around like a pet fucking dog. I thought you wanted to try for medical school. So what do you want, Jack? What's the future got in store for you? You guys were all heroes in the war. Every single one of you. Even if your next door neighbor or your wife never know it and don't give a rat's ass. Fuck belts and medals and citations and parades. Fuck the public who are bored with returning GIs. I have nothing but respect for what you guys and the rest of the six have done. You go through with this, and you'll be nothing to me. Bam. And then they go through with it. Bam. What a fucking boss. Like Jack is so, basically fucking Bucky. So I love, what a boss. I love that That's we, the real version. Yeah. So we get that, right? And it's like... The morphine heist was also Cole's fault. Mm. He gets shot for That's all that bullshit. Indirect. It's way indirect. Yeah, but he gets shot for all that bullshit, and then he goes home way early, Look. recovers, becomes a cop, I, I, and then you they can, you can you can pin it if you want, but it's loose. no, no, not direct. It's not his fault. Like he did it, but like his promotion is like. The, the promotion from is what the catalyst. It, yes, it's the yes, catalyst yes. for all of it. There's one thing I will say is if ever some old soldiers come back from the war and they don't want to talk about it, don't fucking ask Bring them it about it. Jeez, don't shake that fucking tree. 